Whoa, 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 I heard oh, who's here. the Trailer King? And I know, I know he is not talking about Consuelos. He is not talking about Consuelos Chili Verde because hands down, the best in the world. Right, guys? So, how about this? Trailer King, CJ Tino, why don't you tell your little chump line buddies to get out of the ring and the Consuelos burrito eating, beer drinking, resident redneck of the EWF and the captain of the chump line, the Chipotle eating, <laughs> cardio loving, Michelob ultra, probably white claw drinking. I can tell. How about you and me go one on one and I show you what a real man looks like and how a real man handles business, son. Well, he, he told us earlier, ladies and gentlemen, King made it clear he was going to go ahead and get a match at some point with CJ Tino and he, he's decided he's going to get it right now. But will Boa Silva and Antonio Rivers, will they leave the ring? More than leave the ring, will they leave ringside? That's the question. Oh, and I can see, wait a minute. Antonio Rivers is now, Antonio Rivers is now on his way over here. Antonio Rivers, by all means, uh, Give me that chair, give me that chair, Paul. In just a moment, we're about to be joined by Antonio Rivers. Also, I see the Fans, this show. match has just been made official. Oh, well, the see, following contest is scheduled for You're lucky to have me. Where's he supposed to put this? What am I going to this to? Yeah, that's what I was wondering. From Boston, Massachusetts. Well, first, congratulations on your victory. Well, There's no surprise. Representing the pump line. I'm the best. The deadlift king, C.J. Tino. That's the man right there, CJ Tino. That is my mentor, that is my teacher, and he is the reason why I just beat that wannabe and kid, Ryan K. What is he, like 30? From where the beer is cold and the necks are red, he is one half of the Empire Wrestling Federation Tag Team Champions, living double wide and dignified, the trailer. Disgusting. This guy is pure scum. You know, he lives in a trailer. CJ Tino is a home owner. Well, I think he owns the trailer, to be honest with you. Yeah, but come on, what is a trailer? That's not a home. That's a piece of junk. Well, just but, like him. but you cannot deny that Trailer King is one of the most accomplished wrestlers in the EWF. He's been the American champion. He's a three time tag team champion. I mean, he's really on his way here. Yeah, but he's poor. No, it's not that he's poor. He lives fact, in a trailer. He, he's frugal with his money, yes, that's true. But uh, You don't have to be frugal when you're as wealthy as the pump line. Well, however, all of that money did not buy you the EWF championship. CJ Tino, who right here in this very building, with the, shall we say, assistance of the two We're not of assistants, you, we're teammates. I'm saying, all right, with the assistance of his teammates, still was unable to win the EWF championship. You know, that was a multi-man match. There's, we were only leveling the odds, if anything. It was supposed to be a three-way, and you came in and attacked everybody under the sun. As we see it locking up right now, Colin Elbow tie up. No one is as strong as CJ. Look how he manhandles him into the corner. Well, uh, I would say Oh, not wow, of course he would. Though CJ Tino is certainly a incredible physical specimen and a, a very talented wrestler and there we go. a incredibly fit athlete where he doesn't need to take shortcuts like pulling on the hair like we just saw. Yeah, where do we see that? That's called tactics and strategy. And that wasn't his hair pull, that was a mask pull. You better get that right next time. No, no, I'm talking about what we just saw here. Right there was CJ Tino pulling the hair of the trailer kid. Trailer bomb. It's okay, you'll get it. Now as we get ready to watch them lock up, again, Greco-Roman knuckle lock coming here. Oh! oh, smart move. That was real. That's called intelligence. 
What do you know and, about and that? It, and it was a legal maneuver. There's Not no illegal. question about that. It was absolutely legal. Trailer King shoots him off the ropes. Let's see what happens from here. Oh my! Oh, geez, that's oh. that football background comes in again. No, he slipped. Comes off the ropes. Oh, leapfrog! What beautiful way! Well done. Goes for the hip toss. Does not get him. Oh, reversal! And brought him down with authority. Come on, CJ. CJ Tino is on, going CJ. to take a moment to readjust those 47 vertebrae in the back there. What do you know about medical stuff? Where did you go to school? Boston College Law School. Yeah, law, not medical. We, we do a lot of med mal. Mm -hmm. Come on, CJ. Basic anatomy. It's taught in classical course. Now, here we go. Both of these two men. Ooh, strong lockup from CJ Tina. I don't know about Trailer King. Ooh, good maneuvering. Smart forearm in the back. Yep, forearm down in the kidney area again. Legal. Oh, and right there, right up a hop. Right up top, right along the shoulder blades. Drives right oh, in no. the midsection. Of course, if you cannot breathe, it is hard to wrestle, and that maneuver takes the air right out of you. So now, Antonio, please tell us a little bit about the training regimen that you as a group go through. I understand you've all been implementing a lot more of jujitsu into cool. your uh, training. Whoa, 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 oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. no, it. hey, put him down. Put him down, Trailer King. No, no. Oh, not like that. No, not like that. We put him down. Uh, all right. Come on, CJ, get out. One. Come on, two. Get out. No. Yes. Oh. That's how you do it, CJ Tino. That's why he's the leader of the pump line. Off the ropes he comes. Oh, that Ooh, short leg drop. drop has worked really well for Trailer King, but not that time. And CJ Tino gets up and goes right back on the offensive, which is exactly what you need to do with the Trailer King. We don't You've waste time. On we do not waste time in the pump line. That is something that my mentor, CJ Tino, has taught me over the years. Off the ropes. Big elbow. Great job. Trailer King tried to block it, was unsuccessful. Oh, and doesn't even make the effort there. Come on, this is over right here. One, One two, ah. no, nope, kick out. Come on, CJ. You know, one thing I can definitely tell you about CJ is he's one of the most composed wrestlers I have ever seen in my life. Through thick and thin, he is always has a plan, and he is always prepared. Well, I will definitely not argue that point. He has always come into these matches well-focused. He's certainly driven. Uh, he has executed every plan. He's going to, even in losses, he, this plan still gets executed as well as it could possibly be done. There's no doubt about that. He's oh, oh my goodness! But you can't plan uh. as much for that. That one you're just going to feel. I mean, it's hard to lift someone when they're as heavy as a you know trailer. Here comes the trailer king off the oh, ropes. Come on. See now There's he's taking the his time. Drop. He's making a mockery of my mentor. Now wait a minute. Wait just a moment. We saw almost the same conduct being done by CJ Tino well, just a few minutes ago. When you are we saw the same conduct from you in your prior match. But we're both better than our opponents, so we can take liberties. Oh, Trailer gracious. King is making a mockery. Oh, there it is, a scientific thumb to the eye. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. So I would say that, that is a little bit beneath an, uh, an athlete of his caliber. Nothing is beneath us. We're above everything. See, he follows the rules. He's oh, like, with the referee right in his face, he does. So now as we see, though, again, the advantage right now is firmly in the hands of CJ Tino. He's not going to go for the vertical souple. Up, oh, and over. Well done. He's a deadlift king, of course. Of course, he can't go the trailer king. One, two, three. No. Ah, come on, CJ, that had. Ugh. Now that is not composed. We're seeing frustration on the look of He's only human. CJ Tino's face. He is only human. Oh. But you know what? Who's still on top? Yeah, Trailer King throwing those punches, but they're they're well short. Way short. Tino is Tino is moving right out of the way at the last second, getting nowhere with those. And now takes the boots to him. Now here's the question. CJ Tino is such a gifted athlete. He's such a, a well-skilled wrestler. Why does he resort to tactics such as this? Because over the years, CJ has been the nice guy, the hug him all. But you know what? One thing that he always fell short to was dirty tactics. And we discovered through thick and thin that the solution to that is to play people by their own games and beat them. Okay. Well, well, first of all, we haven't seen dirty tactics from 
Trailer King. Secondly, oh, no dirty tactics? Come on. Secondly, we, you've used these dirty tactics, and you have yet to win a championship here in the EWF. I've been let, yet oh. to have an opportunity for one. Well, I mean, by you, I'm sorry, I mean all of Pump Line. CJ Tina was unsuccessful, even with all of you in the Dirty Tactics. In the meantime, now we see Trailer King starting to fire back. There's the hard right hand! CJ Tino still on his feet, but that may not last for long. Oh, the big knee oh left, but he's still standing. Oh my God. Give him credit there. Oh, the flying shoulder block. Now he goes down. Up. Oh, no, my no, goodness, no. he's got him down. And after you see, oh, River, Rivers has just left. And he's got Boa Silva with him. Look at him now, look at him. I don't know if the camera can catch him, but there they are, right at ringside. Or near ringside, and here it comes. And he gets him too! He's laid out two of the pump line. Here comes Bo Silver, he throws him out! That's it, the referee's gonna call this a disqualification. Here He's gonna throw this match out. And now, as we can see, this has just turned Ladies into another and gentlemen, brawl. The referee has declared this match a no contest. Now, that is not gonna stop anybody when we get to the Steel Cage War, May 19th in San Bernardino. They, they will all be locked inside of a steel cage. They will enter one by one over two minute periods until all six are in the ring. And at that point then, there'll be a fight until there is a winner. 